I can't believe we didn't find God in Jerusalem. Well, we'll have to keep looking. Oh, here's our bus to the airport. <laughs> oh, wow, that was super loud. Well, Lois, I happen to be a Muslim now, which means I'll be spending a lot of my time in mostly empty cafes watching soccer on an 8-inch black and white TV. Peter, this is my friend Omar. He can teach you many things about our faith, including how to ululate. What's that? It's this. Oh my God, that's terrifying. I don't know if I'm ready for that. No, Peter, it's okay. Just sing the beginning of La Bamba, but don't say the La Bamba part. Oh, okay. La, 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 yes, good job. You're doing it. Bamba. Ooh, so close. What are you talking about? I'm talking about Mahmoud. You know, I actually feel really bad for him. Do you know he knew 19 guys who died on 9-11? I mean, what are the odds? Peter, I think you joined a terrorist sleeper cell. I'm going to call Mahmoud right now on this cell phone he gave me. He'll tell you. Damn phone's busted. Maybe I'll drive! <laughs> Okay, you're good to go. We'll go celebrate at the clam. That's a great idea. Yeah, I think we could all use a drink. Tell you what, let me call Horace and tell him to get our table ready. Hey, did you just... Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Allahu Akbar! Get home before Stewie gets hurt, like Fozzie Bear when he went to Saudi Arabia. Uh, it's good to worship Allah, because I used to worship Summer. Waka waka. I once knew a guy who was so Arab. How Arab was he? Uh, he was so Arab that everybody liked him, and there was nothing funny about him at all. But you've missed so much. Like when America was attacked by mentally challenged suicide bombers. Allahu Akbar! I'll be with Allah soon. What? Uh, yeah, he doesn't know what he's saying. He's delirious. Look, you better get moving. All right, Stewie, let's go get the sleigh ready. Is anyone else a little freaked out by that Allah thing? Never mind that. Let's just get going. Good evening, I'm Tom Tucker. And I'm Joyce Kinney. Our top story, Quahog prepares to unveil a new statue commemorating perhaps its greatest hero ever. That's right, Tom. It was ten years ago that an almost inconceivable plot to destroy the World Trade Center was thwarted by Quahog's own Brian Griffin. This amateur video captured Griffin's heroism in the face of a shadowy terrorist organization called Holy <laughs> Look at all those vowels. al qai -e Here, make sure you get all this. <laughs> Time to terrorize the terrorists. Ugh, you prepared catchphrases for yourself? No, not necessarily. <laughs> Mohammed Atta stayed home. Nobody knows that guy's name yet. You're using information that nobody knows. Houston, we have a solution. Houston's for space, not everyday air travel. Tell him to ground every plane out of the East Coast. Seacrest out. <laughs> Wow, what a hero. Coming up next in sports, Arizona Cardinal Pat Tillman, tackled by his own team. Oh, Brian, we're so proud of you. Yeah, buddy, great job stopping those terrorists. And thank God their follow-up attack on St. Louis was a bust. We missed!